All Greetings. right. Oh, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> Welcome back. Uh, we are doing some more StarCraft Legacy of the Void co-op. Uh, this time, again, random map, normal difficulty, but we did get a different random map. Rifts to Core Hall. Mm. All right, so it looks like we have to destroy Void Shards and prevent Void Shards from activating, uh, which I think means we'll probably need to dive out of our comfort zone and into enemy territory fairly regularly. Speaking of out of our comfort zone, last time we played the basic heroes for these oh races. Oh god. This time we're playing the advanced ones. Indeed. To uh -oh. ensure our victory, oh, I morph drones two at a time. Interesting. Main objectives. We are, um... Not... Yeah. This is it. Yeah. So, um, we are trying the more advanced of uh, heroes. I'm going with Zagara, who will spawn eventually. I'm got Swan, so I'm all vehicles basically. Uh, yeah. Oh, yeah. You're going Mech. Uh, it looks. Wow, so my drones spawn two at a time and only cost one uh, upkeep for two. Nice. Okay, so let's go heavy into Vespi now. Uh, okay, a little more comfortable than I was. So my laser drill starts in a building phase and it has to actually get built. Sounds familiar. Come on, spawning pool. Uh, the drones do cost 75 for me, so I guess I only get 25% off. Okay, we're looking at some marines up there. That is a building you want to sit on top of this widget. Okay, the spawning pool is up, which means we want queens, which means I want another hatchery. What am I even doing? <laughs> Alright, aberrations. Oh, uh, I have to build factory. Of course. I'm making vehicles. All right, I've got all that running. Okay, that spawns in and lets me build aberrations. Good to know. Baneling nest. Our heroic fortitude. Okay, we go with melee attack. Oh yeah, I don't have ranged ground units. Okay. I do. I haven't used half of these me uh, mechanical units before, so that'll be interesting. I need to spawn a creep tumor. Oh, that's Jeez. why I built. This is going to be complicated. Okay, you want to creep over there. Come back. Okay, evolution chamber in either layer or hive. Get thee to a layery. Okay, creep tumor. Metamorphosis completed. Main objective located. Okay. It must be destroyed. Ah, demolition job. Piece of cake. Main objective located. We must destroy it. Come, my children. We have an objective to annihilate. Okay. My laser drills online. Alright, does this thing drain my health? Great enemy Terrans! Hate these guys. 
that my laser? Yeah. Right, I'm shooting the void shard while you deal with things. Alright. God, I don't know what any of this does. Main objective destroyed. We will not rest until the swarm is triumphant. Okay, that wasn't too bad. Main objective located. Yeah, no doubt it's gonna get way we worse. We must destroy it. We blow the thing up. We go home. Sound good? Hey, I don't know. You make it sound so easy. What does this thing do? <laughs> Not promising. Not promising. Guys coming after our base. I mean, I got some some tanks that do some things. I don't know what those things are, really. Totally ready to ambush these guys. I guess I should build an armory. That probably would be a good idea. Like it. All right, I'm coming in behind these guys. All right. Our allies are in combat. All right, that worked. Um, go repair the dude, SCV. Okay, I need more minerals. I'm so slow. All right, that is in the works. Wave of drones. Nest. At least I don't have any buildings to build up front. Did I build the Baining Nest? I did not. Okay, Adrenal Overload. Lots of upgrades that you can research eventually. Heroic Fortitude. Oh, oh we're not yeah. destroying these things. Um, that's true. Okay, let me gather my troops. Didn't I build a bunch of aberrations, or was that a, a lie? That was barely... I see one. <clears throat> An enemy attack approaches our base. It must be dealt with. At least we only have to deal with things from one direction, it seems. Yeah. Uh, so yeah, we need right. to attack those shards, because if we if they activate, we lose. Evolution oh. Completed. Is that how so that works? Let's push forward. We yeah. can intercept these dudes on the way. All right. All right, my cyclone can attack here. Oh, that's good. That's good. I'm gonna frenzy everyone. I like this drill. Eaten up by this hybrid. I'm shooting it as best I can. Our forces are under attack. The hybrid is down. Right, the void chart is going. Yep. Uh, how? No dudes left. Hey, destroying stuff. That's easy. 
Oh, Aw, damn it. What? Uh, so I, I need to pull back a bit. Okay. And since they had air power. Objective located. Destroy I'm also if you going are able. to build some missile turrets. Oh, I have an armory. Oh, that's right. I have a Got an enemy attack. fuck's sake. I need to pay more buddy. attention. I can upgrade my um, laser drill. Oh, Whoa. we have a pirate ship coming towards our base. Pirate ship? Yeah, it's the yellow triangle on the left, right side of the map. Is it moving? Oh, yeah, you can upgrade to a second base. Oh, the pirate ship is a, um, a bonus objective. Evolution yeah. Completed. Cigar, where did you go? Oh, uh, she's taken a while. She has not come back Our nearly as fast. Have met the All right. All right, let me just restock on circling real fast. Because all my units spawn really fast, but I actually only have half the population max that I should. Oh, interesting. I am eternal. Okay, let's go. I've got some anti-air troops in the back. I have my goliaths. Evolution complete. We have to destroy 10 of these void shards. We're about to get to the third one. You want to wrap back around and kill this pirate ship? Sure. Can we go to that side? Oh. Main objective located. It must be destroyed. Okay. Got it. I'm ready to take that thing down whenever you are, chief. Let's wow. toast. Bonus objective completed. I don't know what to think about this uh, new unit. Enemy attack upon our base. Show them no mercy. I'm gonna go expand. Oh. What? I need to upgrade to Hive, of course. Banelings, upgrading. I have a concentrated Evolution beam now. Completed. Cool. Metamorphosis. Okay, so we complete. have six minutes until a void shard activates. Okay. Dude, this beaming thing is awesome. Yeah. It the the fact that it auto targets Evolution is very helpful. Complete. Okay. I'm about ready to go in. Okay. I'm right behind you. So what does this do? Oh, check this out. What? That was a concentrated beam build. All right, I frenzied everything. Yeah, 
Okay, I'll stay in the front. Let's keep going. Targeting the command center. Targeting the shard. Okay, I'm gonna pull my units back together. I wish I have. Where are they? Bonus objective located. Destroy it if you are able. I'm gonna focus this void shard down. Okay, there are bad guys that I can't attack that are like on my unit pathing. There's a bunch of flying. Uh, we don't need to worry about it. Well, my missile turrets will take care of it. No, not quite. Right. I just need to recoup anyway. I'm just gonna hang out over here so your beam will do work on this thing. Okay. I forgot about my other base entirely. I'm so good at this game. <laughs> I, I need to build a starboard. Like, I have not done that at all. <laughs> oh, oh. I think I have built all my buildings, but I, I say that. Our forces are under attack. Metamorphosis completed. Distracting the Marines with your bodies, corruptors. The Zagar is pretty serious here. Alright, what can I do? I have. Trans the Hercules transport seems a bit wasted on. I agree, although it can jump your units into combat. That's true. I mean, it does have, like, a ton of space, so it can move all my vehicles, but, you know. Is there a limit to how much Vespine we get? 
There is. Wait. Oh, you mean yeah, they'll Revolution exhaust, right? Yeah. Completed. Man, we're gonna get so many snarky comments about how much we blow. <laughs> What is, what, what's attacking where? All right, we have four minutes until a shard activates, and they're all grouped together, so we need to Let's move. build. I'm, I'm ready. Oh, I'm building up a little bit more. All right, well, I'll start assaulting their defenses because I have this, like... And my laser will do some stuff. Yeah. Looks like we can just rally up to here. We got two minutes. Main objective destroyed. We gotta focus down these things. Yep. Our forces have met the enemy in our allies are in combat. Okay, one left. Well, that thing's toast. Okay, now the hybrid's gone. Everyone kill it. Woo. All right. In the nick of time. Oh, indeed. <laughs> All right, so... Ooh. I like Swan better, I think, than than Rainer. Zagar is tough. Uh, she's got a bunch of specialist units that is uh, a little bit harder to deal with. I think with more upgrades, you can make a more solid. I mean, she can build a million units. All right. So I, as usual, or not as usual, as last time, got one level, and mm -hmm. the earned reward that I got was the combat drop. Calls down four Ares Warbots, stunning enemy ground units in the drop zone. The Warbots are controllable and fight for 60 seconds. Next unlock for me is Betty and the Gang. Increases the attack range of Devastation turrets from 6 to 9. Attacks now slow enemy movement by 30%. Increase the life of missile turrets from 250 to 325. Attacks now deal area damage reduces the cost of perdition turrets by 50%. So that's a big upgrade. Wow, that's that's like three different kinds of turrets. It's all my turrets. All your turrets get significant upgrades. That's awesome. Well, let's see. So, yep, I almost hit two levels. Um, and for Zagara, I earned a uh, call down roaches, or it's infested drop. So you call down roaches with time life to any location on the map. Oh, drop pods deal damage on impact and inject larva so nice a universal or a global call down is pretty good and then inject larva increase the number of larva produced by the queen spawn larva ability from four to eight um <clears throat> that means i can spend less of my resources on uh the hives because i built four of those and 
you really do have to keep up because she spawns and morphs everything faster uh, and only has a hundred population cap Zagara just continuously reinforces her uh, army and you definitely need that one of the pitfalls I'm seeing for Zagara is if the enemy attacks you in multiple places your force may be out in the boonies while your base is getting ravaged and you can't respond mm. terribly well to that. Um, Zagara with might... Swan, yeah? I was going to say with Swan, uh, the problem is mostly uh, there's units that I've never used before. So the, the Hellbat existed already, I think, in multiplayer before. Yeah. I, uh, I just never played multiplayer. So... I'm only used to it as the uh, the regular go kart mode, <laughs> and then the cyclone. Uh, cyclone looks it's it's like the um, the whirlwind in the Space Marines for Dawn of War. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh, I'm not sure that I like it that much, um, but I, I need to be able to look at these things while I'm not under imminent threat of death. <laughs> yeah, definitely have to uh, to round out our Starcraft experience a little bit. So I think we should end this episode and then we should play one more game because we get some kind of achievement for playing three co-op missions. All right. Sounds good to me. All right. So we're going to cut out here in a minute. Uh, this is the second of these we've done. We're going to do a third one and we'll, we'll, we'll post them fairly close together. Uh, and we'll continue playing sloppily and embarrassing ourselves. But until you see us next time, eh, I don't care what you do. <laughs> what he said.